Happy Black Friday, Gunpla Modelers. This is Strider Prime, and today I'm going to talk about all the upcoming deals that we're going to be seeing now for the Black Friday sales at our favorite websites. I can imagine that right now many of you have already uh, spent God knows how many hours outside of Walmart or, or Best Buy or Target or or other chain stores that are doing some amazing Black Friday deals and hopefully getting that special you know special item that's really cheap you know that cool little uh, TV that um, that blu-ray player that you guys wanted a nice jacket for for someone a, stock, a couple of stocking stuffers here and there and of course many of you are probably doing the same thing online purchasing online items but I want to show off those those uh, people who are interested in getting good deals on model kits for Gundam. Uh, for Gundam. And right now I want to show off uh, three sites, actually two sites, that are offering um, Black Friday deals. First up, of course, is Hobby Link Japan. They're doing their Black Friday deals. Um, they're, the Black Friday deals for them will last from November 23rd up to the 27th. So pretty much they're gonna get they, they have a lot of things on sale at their site um, I had the, the the site hasn't been updated yet on my on my uh, tablet so so I want to show this first before whatever but they're offering six levels of savings pretty much they're ranging from 500 yen a thousand yen 1500 yen 2,000 yen 3,000 yen and 5,000 yen Pretty much almost all of the items, as it says here on the site, will be at 50% off. Um, I could have easily recorded what items are going to be showing, but there's probably so many that it's going to take me a long time to cover it. So just head on over to uh, Hobby Link, hit refresh, and hopefully you find that special item that you guys are looking for this holiday season. Now that's for, of course, um, in Ho uh, Hobby Link. Gundam Planet, on the other hand, has a Black Friday sale of their own, which I'm waiting for their page to kick in so I can show you. Uh, for those of you who probably are not aware, Gundam Planet is here in New Jersey. So if you guys are in the Eastern Seaboard, you'll get this kit from their site quickly. Uh, where's the Black Friday deals? Come on. Let me just refresh the page. And there we go. So let's click on this and they have some pretty good deals. Pretty much they have a lot of items that's gonna be 30% off, but the more unique deals are like this one. And I hate this little thing on the side. Uh, you can get the Master Grade Age One Normal, Titus, and Spallow for 34, well actually not 30, uh, yeah, 34.95 or $100 for three kits. I think that's a reasonable price. Um, the the Mars size is going to be forty bucks. The Master Grade Blue f uh, Astray Blue Frame Second Revise is going to be fifty five. There is the uh, Buster for forty six. The uh, Aegis is going to be uh, fifty six dollars. The G Armor real type color version, ninety dollars. The extra finished version of the Master Grade Strike Freedom is going to be ninety. Master Grade Ver Two, uh, Ver Master Grade Zeta Gundam version two point oh, that's uh, fifty six dollars. Brazil is going to be forty six. I'm just going to go down to the list. There's going to be a lot of kits here that's going to be on sale. I'm not going to read the whole thing. Go onto their website, see if there's some a kit that you want. They're even starting to sell AG kits. They weren't they were not selling AG kits for a while, but I guess they got their hands on it. So head on over to um, to Gundam Planet's website and see uh, if there's something that you guys want. I'm not, I received also. Um, hang on a second. I got to refresh the page. I think I also got a message from Hobby Wave of their Black Friday deals, but for some unknown reason they're not loading up and I have a distinct feeling their site may be uh, getting bombarded with people uh, ordering stuff from their site as well. Um, I guess we're going to have to forget on uh, looking at that website. But anyway, 
that's pretty much the items that now we're now seeing on sale for Black Friday. Plot Japan has Black Friday sale. Plot Japan is also in the, on the western side of the United States. So their stock is very limited. So head on over and see if there's something there. Didn't see any notifications from Gundam, uh, Gundam Store and more. Maybe they'll do something later on. Who knows? But uh, that's pretty much is what's out there for any cool deals for Black Friday. Well, this video is not going to be complete without me showing off my new acquisitions. This is my Black Friday deal that just came in recently. Actually, these are kits that I purchased along, you know, a couple of, you know, weeks ago. And, well, actually, no, I purchased this um, a couple of weeks ago. And it, for, and it finally came in on Monday. This one I picked it up last Saturday. And I thought, let me show it to you guys all and show you the, the new items that I've just recently got my hands on. Uh, we all know where this came from, but this, on the other hand, and as a matter of fact, let me pull this to the side so you guys can see what I got. This one is courtesy of Gundam Planet. Those guys have been very, very nice to me, and uh, I, I thank them for them. They've helped me out a lot. And uh, I said, you know what, I'm going to pick this kit up from their website, I mean from their uh, store that's in... Uh, that's in New Jersey, and it is Master Grade Aegis from the uh, Gundam Seed animated series. This is the last Gant machine that just recently came out. Um, they finally, of course, released all the uh, GAT kits. And uh, even though I never, um, I kind of uh, acknowledge all the uh, the other three suits. The Buster is actually pretty pretty good looking kit. I'm more in favor with this one than any of the other kits combined. So this was something that I really wanted to get for quite some time. The, I love the box art. It's nice and huge. Um, a lot of detail for this kit. So I'm kind of glad that I picked this up. So thank you for thank you to uh, Gundam Planet for. Uh, having this off to the side. I will definitely do more business with them. Now, as from Hobbylink, the reason why I purchased something from Hobbylink is I purchased from Hobbylink instead of uh, Gundam Planet is because there were certain items that I wanted. And at the same time, I wanted to, uh, I said, oh, I'll hold on and pick up some other kits at the same time. considering that the boxes are literally the same size dimension as the kits themselves. So I'm going to have to be yanking something out and bending. There we go. Now I actually had to hold out because the two of the kits that I wanted came in, they had it in stock. The th I, have, I have three kits. So you guys know. The third kit I had to wait until it was in stock. All right. So first things first. Let me show you the non-Gundam kit that I purchased, and I've been waiting for this, and I can't wait to build this as well as the other kit that I purchased, and that is the United Nations Cosmo Navy Combined Cosmo Fleet from the Space Battleship Yamato 2199 TV series, um, excuse me, uh, anime series. Um, I've been a big fan of Yamato way before Gundam. It was, it was the first anime that I was exposed to. And seeing these ships, seeing these designs, it's amazing to look at. Um, clearly, there's a lot, clearly there's a lot of detail at a 1-1000 scale uh, one one thousand scale of these kits. I'm definitely want to get the um, the Gamelon ships or the Gamelisk ships as they're uh, referred to in the series. But these are like I like this ship. I kind of like this one, and I like this new one. This, this is actually considered a uh, a cruiser. Well, this is a battleship, and this is a destroyer. Um, so I got this one at a, a good price. 
the next one that I got, and I said, you know what? Considering that the Ronin Zulu is coming out, which is piloted by Angelo uh, Serpa, I thought, you know what? I might as well get the other mobile suit that he's been piloting, and that is the Gira Zulu Angelo Serpa Use. Custom, I would probably consider it a custom. Basically, it's his mobile suit with this uh, massive, uh, um, massive cannon that he has. It looks pretty cool. I kind of like it. I like the designs. Um, this is kind of cool. I, I, I actually got uh, the opportunity to see this kit first uh, um, clearly at uh, at the uh, Comic Con show. So I said, you know what? That's kind of like that. I really do like it, this kit. The next kit that I ordered, uh, I had to wait until it was available at Hobby Link. And uh, last, I think it was last Thursday, they uh, I received the email saying that, oh, it's we have your kit. Do you want us to ship it? And I said, yes, you better ship that. And then a couple of days later, since I ordered it through FedEx, I said, let me get this immediately. And I got this guy. Master Grade Age 2 Dark Hound. Gundam from the Mobile Suit uh, Gundam Age animated series. This is the Master Grade that everybody's been waiting for, and uh, I was planning to get the high grade version, but I said, you know what, the Master Grade is coming down the road, and I'm picking this guy up, and this is my choice. And I'm, I'm glad I got it. It's a beautiful looking kit, as you can see there. Wow, it's amazing. So, here's my Black Friday deals for today. So, I'd like to thank you guys for watching this. And stay tuned for more Gundam models yet to come. Take care. You know what? Let's not, I don't want to end it like this. No, I don't. I'm interested in building this guy, but I'm also interested in building him. Let's put these guys to the side, and let's take a look at these two Master Grade kits. Huh. Both look cool. Both look amazing. Both are transformable. And as you guys know that I'm currently uh, working on the... Uh, Victory Gundam, I am interested in making another mastery after Victory. So I'll tell you what. Let's put it to a vote. You guys got one week to tell me, should I build Aegis or should I build Darkhound? Aegis, Darkhound. Begin commenting now.